Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-He, the reason you see me. Boss. Yeah, man. Hey, man. Listen, man. Check it, man. Boss Talk 101, man. What a boss's talk, man. We just tapping in, man. Little running mother elf is joining us, man. We just having a good time, man. You did. What's man, going on? I had a couple of things I really like. I do news you can use a lot of times okay. on my other plat, but, but my other back end, but I wanted to do something right quick, man. I was looking at uh, different things that went on this week, and I always look at the things. A lot of times people inbox me. A lot of times people ask me to talk about it. I got calls today to talk about different things. I can't even remember but what all it was, but it was about three or four things, which I'm probably not going to hit on one of them because I'm just not, you know, I'm not in, I didn't write it down. Don't be mad at me because I know y'all know who I'm talking to. Like, man, you <laughs> ask my question. Yeah. <laughs> but I was, uh, the one big thing that stuck out to me was academics, man, when he went off on Erica Badu. Erica Badu, let me tell you this. You keep my name out your mouth too. I see you mention. Listen, that whole little everyday struggle shit, that was another era, my nigga. I'm down to violate all you niggas these days. You know what I'm saying? For him to go off on Erica, man, and this seemed like it was something, I know it was four or five years ago that mm -hmm. she called him, because it was when he was with, I want to say that was when they was doing that other podcast, and it was him and two of the girl and the, and the guy. And, and So that's when the, whatever he was talking about? Yeah, that's because what Because when I saw it, I was like, why he coming up? Because I heard you say something like that before, but I'm like, why are you coming up and saying this now? Or was that an old post? No, that's the that's real. Recent. That's recent. So why he coming up with it now if it's something that's old? I just think that something happened to where he was fed up. He you something know, triggered. He's a real troll. So she might have did something to somebody that he liked or something that he didn't just quite fit with. And went in on her because oh, he needed some content that day. Oh, yeah, he needed yeah, some content. It has, to, it has to be because if it was something that triggered, you would think he would have put it out and say, mm -hmm. you know, she did this and this and this and this, but it sort of so vague. Like you just coming up with something from old stuff. That I make saw no a sense. small clip of him. Um, I seen the time that she said he he looked like um look Mickey. You no, see that? Yeah, I saw what she said Mickey. that, and then I, I ran into that, a clip but with you him didn't see it. cussing, cuss just. I see that boom, boom, boom. and I was like, I see that bitch follow me. I'm like, bitch, why are you following me? I don't fuck with you. I'm not in on no joke with you. Bitch, you came up in here raving around Sage and all that type of shit. Fuck y'all niggas. Yeah. All right, now, at what point do you draw the line on disrespect? This was years ago, like too. That dude was disrespecting her. Yeah. You didn't because see somebody You just seen this recently because that clip just came up. Because it, it just. Yeah. But you didn't see it when it originally happened because it didn't mean nothing. It didn't mean nothing. Yeah. It didn't mean nothing. But to him, it cause she even said it on one of her live posts. She was like, you know, somebody would say something after all these years. You could tell she was pretty much subliminally talking about him. She didn't mention his name, but she kind of just spoke on the fact like, yeah, you know, somebody got in their feelings pretty much is the way I would have said it. You know what I'm saying? And and basically, man, she he cussed all county. He called her bees and I, I this. See, I and saw that. I ain't letting you make it a hole and beep, beep, beep. He went in, bro. And then he said something about, y'all gonna have to just come see me. Yeah, he went in like he was I'm talking like, to man, the city. Hey, I, I, I kind of felt kind of some kind of cool, way. That's cool, but it's, it's, it's too many people that, that love that woman. I'm not even talking about fans. We talking about, this, she, it's people that got the exact not same blood flowing. Not just in Dallas, in, exactly. not just in Texas. You know when people call her mother? Exactly. Right. I, I just, I don't feel, um, in my heart, you don't disrespect no woman like that. Right. Because that's somebody, mama, sister, um, daughter. Uh, any like you, if you ain't been disrespect, like I didn't see no disrespect in what she said, bro. Mm -hmm. I, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't say that disrespect, but it just depends. Some people can look at him and be like, Well, you must have mommy issues, or you must be having some other type of issues. Because for anybody to call other females and do that, mm -hmm. have issues, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, I watch his content, y'all don't get mad at me, but I've been watching him and, and I like what I was seeing to like to that that Still situation. That mm -hmm. But all the stuff I rock with him, like like I see what he trying to do, the things that he's doing, Speak his platform, against, the right. way that he when the, he went in on the old like the old rappers, him and LL had got into mm -hmm. it, him and Russell Simmons. Mm -hmm. He said something about it. He made his own way. I rock with that cause mm -hmm. like he did make his own way. Mm -hmm. He did create his own success. But the Erica Badu thing kind of, you know, being in Dallas, it was mm -hmm. like, damn, man. I was, you know how you be like, damn, why you do that? You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Get home. Yeah, because I'm like, you know, we here and it make it seem like the way he said, nigga, I'm like, nigga, y'all, what y'all gonna do about it? Pretty much, you know, and he's just trying to taunt somebody. Term. He's trying to taunt somebody. I don't know who, who got like. under his skin, though, but I, I hope he'll, 
you know, you know, I ain't never seen him really just recant much. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That ain't his style. I don't think he would. He goes in and 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 like I said, he feel like a lot of times the ones who already been in position like Erica Badu that they kind of don't respect what he's created. Mm -hmm. And I know that cause of the old conversation with the old rappers that he mm -hmm. had had where I think he feel like they just don't respect what he created and he really created a a multi-million dollar operation mm -hmm. right here in the midst of the same thing I was talking about earlier when we was interviewing. Mm -hmm. You can take something and create something and cure it to where nobody has done it before, mm -hmm. bro. And I think that's something that more of us need to try to channel our energy into. Nah, facts. And he figured it out. I'm he, telling you. He figured, he figured it out for sure the more it's called of the internet. He knows. How to get some money out the internet. He know how to get some money. He know but, how to create but some money. At what point of getting some money out the internet do you go, like, maybe that's just his character. See, I don't know, bro, so I can't speak I never, on that. I never met him. You know uh, what I mean? I never met him before, but definitely, uh, nigga's a hell of an influence, but. He had me laughing. I, I've, like you said, I've laughed and enjoyed everything up to that. Yeah. That kind of was disgruntling. That that kind of make you like, damn, you know, like, damn, man. No, not Erica, man. No, she ain't. She ain't really just, you know, he even talked about her messing with young niggas at the, at the like, you, 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 you niggas see you going out here trying to holler at these young niggas, these young rappers, that's how you, he was on her, man. He's, he's studying her too close. Like, he's studying her. studying too close. Man, it might be, you know, hey, man, you know, she still got it. You know, he might watch one of my old videos, you know what I'm saying? Still fine. Still fine, man, after all this time. But mm -hmm. check it, man. Hey, so what else you got? Well, y'all know I love the movie Blindside, right? Mm -hmm. Man, because I watched that movie, and you know I got motivation I watched over for over and over movie. and over again because I love true stories. Ain't true story I love. And we watched it so many times. Well, I was shocked when I was scrolling through and saw this came up, and first thing it says, Sandra Bullock should give back her Oscar award for Blindside. Reason being, they said that um, Michael... Or mm -hmm. did not get any money from that movie. And that movie made millions of dollars. It all went to the family, and he didn't get any. As much as, yes, he went to the NFL mm -hmm. and made money and all of that stuff, but that is his name. That was a movie on his life. On his life, yeah. And that should go towards him. But in my readings, it said that the money went to their kids, which is not him. Mm hmm you Did he stay with him? Yes, but it went well, to the other I'm just, kids. I mean, I'll be real with you. Uh, he would get money and then he'll fail. Did he blow his money? Is that why he coming out now? You know, yeah. these niggas will blow their money, like too. why you come out You know what I'm On ESPN, he, 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 he said it's not even based on a true story. He said it's based on a lie. Oh, So no, that's not was, the full story. That what, hey, that what he said. He said it ain't, even, it ain't even based on a true story. But even if it's not based on a true story, but it's still about, about you. About his life. About your life. Mm -hmm. Why... Why only coming out now after so many years of this movie being out and all this money being accrued? Why didn't you say something back then, or did you? And you you didn't get anywhere, so now you're coming out to the media about it. I wouldn't say that. I know a lot of the times in this in this game of um, attorneys, mm -hmm. they'll tell you let it sit, let it accumulate money mm -hmm. before we go out of it. We don't want to go out there prematurely and scare them off or make them pull it and, you know, boo, boo, boo. That thing generated $309 million. Mm -hmm. If he can win anything in court, it's money there to be given to him. Right. Like any judge that would say, well, give him this, they going to have to send that. Ain't going to be no, they we don't have it. it. They, they got, got to send, send it. it. Mm -hmm. You made that. But I don't think it's fair, like me personally. And I think the way in which they're saying it, and the reason why they're saying it, because Sandra Bullock is the bigger person. Mm -hmm. um, so they're, they're to bring attention to the situation. Mm -hmm. They're saying that she needs to give back the Oscar. But I don't think she needs to give back the Oscar because she did her do. She did her job. Right. Yeah, she, Acting she and stuff. She, she did it really well. So I don't see why she's supposed to give back her Oscar. We all believed her acting skills. Mm -hmm. We all believed everything because of how well she acted in that role. We're in the middle of practice, Leanne. You can thank me later. Team is your family, Michael. Mm -hmm. I, said, dude, I well. said do that like, big old black nigga one with him like that. <laughs> Man, he said he wasn't with him, man. It was on today's show. Bro must have woke up. Um, I wasn't with them. Two weeks ago and said, wait a minute, there's a movie about me? <laughs> I wasn't with That's him. That's what you said, right? Like, how you wait this long? He was like, wait a minute, who made a movie about me? He just finally figured it out. He could not. 
He, he, this that's movie been out and everybody <laughs> so, know about man, it. Listen, if anybody bro, walk hey. past him and see me, like, oh, you Michael? Oh, bro, I know your bro, story. Bro, that was a good ass movie, bro. Yeah, it was a real good movie. I, I, I watched it on the night, to be honest with y'all. Y'all play. <laughs> Okay, what's your most favorite part in the movie? Man, I really like the part when he stopped that thing hitting that little boy. I can tell you another part I like. You know what I'm saying? When he drove that little that nigga to the trash can, that uh-huh. big old boy. It's, 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 it's yeah, some cool, it's some like, cool that, moments yes. in that thing, man. I love that I, part. I like the part when that nigga got mad when old boy was talking about his mom and he was mama, in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah, nigga, all these the good like parts. Part, this is a good movie, man. The part man. that was touching to me was the part where Sandra Bullock had to tear up when he's like, is this my, is this my bed? No, she was like, "This is you, this is your room," and he's like, "I never had one before." Mm-hmm. She said, y- "Your own room? No, I never had a bed," and she walked out and cried because and cried, we take yeah. so much things for, you know, granted mm-hmm. to think that everybody might have a bed, but not everybody has ever slept in a bed before in mm-hmm. their life. Mm-hmm. So <laughs> that touched me just that he part said alone. They never adopt him though. But in the show, it showed like they adopted him. Somebody wrote a hell of a storyline, man. Hey, some went on in that first contract that he ain't happy with now. That's what it sounds like. Because mm. I don't think somebody come out this many years later and say, hey, I ain't made no money. Bro, you ain't been making no money if that's the case. Bro, go look mm. back at him how when it first happened and how he, he, I guarantee you can find footage where he was talking about it. It was so about him. But is he talking about not, no, not making talking no bread? About, no, we're talking about the movie and, and just, you know. Was he, he a part of it? Like that's what I'm saying. Go back and find See, now, him. Now I'm a research. He was. If you were part of all of this stuff, yeah. you behind the scenes yeah. when they shoot and they're like, bro, yeah. you just sit down. You just yeah. want some money. That nigga yeah. was that part of it. Lee I know you Because, along. you know, at the end of the movie, at every, at every end of a true story, they show pictures of the yeah. real cat. The he was on them real pictures. The real pictures. Yeah, he he was there. Him, yeah. Man, he was with that family, bro. <laughs> he was with that family. <laughs> that white. It wasn't the same one as Aunt Sandra. Dad, the big old black boy. Dad, 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 the real one. Like, like he was security. He was sitting there with him. You know, the family was sitting there with him. The picture of him and them sitting there. Yeah, that he was with him. But how old was he when this movie was filmed? Shit, I don't know. If he was young and didn't understand, then mm. you know what I mean. No, I don't try Compared to play to it. Ignorant. I gotta play both sides. You know but if you, yeah. yeah, but if you are older now and you have enough sense to understand certain things, and age doesn't matter where legality is concerned, because you have some older people who don't know nothing about yeah. legalities. Yeah, you understand what I mean. Maybe he just now understanding certain things, understand what he could have gotten compared to what. Well, I'm gonna tell you right now, man. Uh, I'm gonna go watch that movie because I, I'm having flashbacks right now. What What did he have on there? Was he diagnosed with? Um, when you talk about his, as far as his, I don't know if he was. He wasn't he just regular. Yeah, was he, he, he was could, dyslexic. It or was because right? he, yeah, something. yeah, he was trying to learn that that teacher came over. It's house. where, yeah. but they taught yeah. him. They taught him in a fashion where he could understand. Okay. Whereas he has like a protective. You have to teach him um, where he can like protect. Like that's how it was where um, he Probably played football. He was a hell of a guard or something. He was mm-hmm. a hell of a guard. You had to be like, this person is your brother. This person is your mother. This mm-hmm. person is whatever. That's how he was able to you register with Sandra it. Sandra Bullock. I'm just saying. <laughs> But they did they have did. him on there as a, as like a working yeah, case is, where they was he, they yeah. was working on him his mental mm-hmm. and all that. Yeah. So if that part is true, they he played. Him. Yeah, there's a word for you, right? They he played him, man. They, they played him. That's where it's. He didn't like, realize till now. Like somebody, one of his old lady, he probably married a bad chick. Somebody and she probably like, told hey, him, baby. Like, "Baby, you didn't get none of that." Oh, if that's the case, I, I would love to see his NFL contract then. Oh right. damn! Ain't no telling what happened. Right. That's why I'm saying all this stuff coming back now. He gonna come back talk about the NFL. The birds didn't give me shit. He better Three try years. to get a concussion because they get paid for them concussions in there. You know that? Are they paying them now? Oh yeah, they paying them for them concussions. If you got concussion back in them days, oh yeah, you can go back now and get your money. They got money for oh, you. Yes, enough money too. Yeah, man. man. Hey, man. Listen, man. Make sure you got like, subscribe to our channel. Make sure you tap in, man. Uh, we just. We just hanging out, man. Talking with my boy, Mr. Little Running Mother Elf and Miss Jamaica's in the building. So we're going to be out here chilling like this all the time so y'all get used to it. Let us know what y'all want us to talk about, man. Miss, me and Miss Jamaica be in here. We trying to figure out what's going to happen next, man. Mm-hmm. Uh, anything else you want to cover before we get off here? I did, but I forgot. Oh, don't worry about else. it, then, man. Hey, it man. something else. Check it, man. Thank you guys for watching. Boss Talk 101, where the bosses talk. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-He, the reason you see me.